Okay, welcome welcome everyone. My name is Kevin King. I'll be your MC for the day. And uh, today is, I don't know if you realize this or not, but today is going to be really the culmination of 40 years of intense research and uh, data collecting and uh, actual implementation. And so today we're talking about our life vision. This is actually completion of year two. If you can believe that, uh, completion of year two, where we are exploring our life vision. And last month we talked about fine-tuning our systems and the two main things about fine-tuning our systems is focus and consistency. It's really important that we have those two things, otherwise we're not able to fine-tune anything. Kevin? Yes? Uh, sorry, the audience is this way. Well, uh, to, the right uh, to, to your right, um, 15 right degrees. Am I? I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm right. so no sorry. Yeah, yeah there, there you go. Okay, yeah. Yeah, so it looks better now. It's been really okay. hard. Yeah, it's been no. really hard for me to just read something. So, great, right. bear with me. Uh, so, so we're going to be going through some things today, and uh, I think I think we got the lay of the land here. Uh, okay. So, uh, so as we get into as we get into the month, what we're going to see is is that here's our 12 month plan. Let's turn around. Okay. Which which way? Turn the this way. Okay. Right. Front so, to back. Okay, like this? Yeah, Okay, sorry about that. The 12 month plan. So here's plan the 12 month game you. plan. Here's no, a 12 month game plan. What's that? It's behind you. The, okay. The I'm so sorry. Did you take the wrong one? Okay. It's not in this stack. Where is it? It's up here? It's right up okay, there. I set you up wrong. Did There's you? No, 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 no. It's, it, it's okay. Is this it? Okay. Yep. Yeah. Okay, great. Okay. Is that it? Yeah. Did I get the right one? Okay, good. So, the 12 month game plan is going to be really clear. But the first thing we need. Okay, I'll be Vanna White. Will you? Will you be Vanna White? Okay. So 12 month game plan is uh, is is an outline here. Did everybody get a fourfold? Did we hand out the fourfold chart? The, the for everyone so they can see the roadmap. We'll get that. We'll get that because that's really important that you'll see it here. Okay. So the important thing is today we're going to be talking about achieving our life vision. It's important that you see this when you're able to, to able to get an idea of where we've been in the last 12 months, actually the last 24 months, actually the last 40 years. Because in, in so doing, we're going to be able to understand how it is that everything we do, family, friends, finances, fitness, everything fits into our life vision. <coughs> Without vision, people perish. That is the bottom line. You can have goals, you can have little itty bitty things along the way, you can even get by for so long, but you're frustrated. Why? Because you have no idea why it is that the dreams that you had as a kid are not being fulfilled as an adult. Why? Because there's nothing that you can do outside of finding your life vision that's going to correct the whole issue. So last month was about fine-tuning systems. There's no reason to fine-tune a system unless we can clearly see what's going on. It's so important. Your perception about life is totally different. Alan Stein says most people walk around like they're like they're in a dream, right? I, I, I look at it as most people are walking around like the living dead, like zombies. Why do you think there's so many programs on today about zombies? Because people resonate somehow with this idea of the living dead, where they're not dead and they're not alive and they just keep living on and on and on and on. What a terrible existence that is because they, there's no clear vision. And that's exactly what happens to people. People around them, it's just like The Matrix. How many people saw uh, the film The Matrix? If you're raising your hand, I really can't see the kind of blur, but <laughs> yes. just, just say, yes, yes I've seen yes. it. Yes. Okay, so you know that there was a, a point at which Neo uh, was talking with uh, uh, the, the guy that, that, that had, had two pills in his hand. Do you remember that scene? And he says, you've been brought out of a dream. You take one pill, you go back down to the rabbit hole, and you're, and you're back into where you are, and you'll never remember any of this again. But you take this one, Dorothy, and you're going to go down the rabbit hole, and you're going to see the things that are for what they really are. And, but you're never going to be able to go back. And that's what it is to have a life vision. Because once you see clearly what's going on, you'll be able to actually take care of what's really happening and actually perceive things for the first time. We talk about see, think, and do. How can you think if you can't see? How can you tell somebody who's blind the color blue? How is that even possible to even communicate that? So to say, hey, you can have a better life. You can have dimensional living. You can have dimensional thinking. Your life will be completely different. This system, trust the system. Trust the BOS, the business operating system. 
Whereas the DNA of business, the DNA of people, the DNA of life, all these things are going to create something. But it, it sounds like, wah, 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 wah. like Charlie Brown's teacher, if we can't see. So you have to take the blinders off. You have to take what has been blinding you all this time and get rid of it. Now you can see vibrant colors. You're able to see things for the first time. As opposed to walking around in a constant dream. can't see, you have a hard time understanding, don't you? But that's where we're at. Why don't we start? Here's the thing I don't understand. I didn't understand at first, and now I'm understanding a whole lot more. Why don't we start, why don't we start with achieving our life vision every year? This really should be the kickoff. And in many ways, today is the kickoff for year three. But well, see, that's, that's the brilliance of what this is. But why don't we start with our life vision? Why don't we start with the value of installing systems? Anyone? Bueller? Bueller? We're all over the age, we know what that reference is, right? Because most people don't have life vision. We can't start there. We have to start looking at the value of installing systems and saying, systems, yeah, systems. They're going to help me get my goals and then generate more better leads. That's what I need, more and better leads. More and better leads because then I'm going to start rocking and rolling with my sales. Oh yeah, I'm going to convert more of those to uh, leads to clients and I'm going to get them faster and then I need a larger quantity of those referrals. Referrals are great because those are great money things and, and, and create client for life for this. Well, okay, it's client for life. Will that get me more of this? Yeah, okay. But pretty soon, once you get into month six, you're starting to see something else develop. Leadership, creating massive profits. It's not just creating clients, it's, it's leadership and then creating profitable partnerships. Now it's leaders partnering with leaders and now it's developing profitable mastermind groups that are training people, that are leaders training leaders, and attracting profitable clients, and then fine-tuning our profitable systems so that we can finally get down to achieving our life vision. So what's the next one? Value yeah, yeah, installing systems. systems. How can we see that if we can't see this? We can't. That's the bottom line. That's why we have to start here. Is that clear? Because today, everything is going to be about achieving our life vision. The DNA of people, the DNA of business, the DNA of life. Everything ties back into your life vision. How many people have gone through the 20-minute life vision exercise? Can you see your hands? I can see them now, right? It's a very simple process. If you haven't done it, do it today before you leave. It's very simple. Eight and a half by 11 sheet of paper. Draw a big circle in it. Everything outside that circle, you write down everything you're passionate about. Everything. Absolutely everything. Thank you, Rosanna. Okay? Here it is. Discovering your life vision. Am I preempting anybody on this? Go for it. You're good. No? Okay. So, take one, pass them around. You can hand those back to there. I'm going to show you this real quick. Everything here has already been outlined for you. You write down everything you're passionate about. Here's some things I'm passionate about. Baking. Love baking. Can't eat those right now. I can't take baking meals right now. The doctor says they're carbs. I don't like my doctor. Okay, absolutely. Maybe it's maybe it's skiing. Maybe it's exercise. Maybe it's maybe it's building your business. Maybe it's loving your spouse. Maybe it's really getting involved with your kids. Whatever you're passionate about, you write everything down. And then in the middle, a clarifying statement, something that resonates not only with you, but if you share it with somebody else, they get it. That's going to be your life vision. We're going to talk about that today. So that's really important what, we, what we're going over. Okay? So when do we want to do the video? I think what we do is the speed coaching. Yeah, uh, like five minutes. Yep. Um, how do we make sure that you know? How do we make sure that we all have the passions and the life vision working on that throughout today? Yes. And then how do we connect our passions and our life vision together? In right. Just be networking with. Absolutely. With uh, Ed. Excellent. So Ed Kirch is going to come up and he's going to do our speed networking. Bring up Ed Kirch. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. He doesn't know who. All right, we're gonna have you two get together because you don't know one another, right? 
How good do you know this is? Probably not very good, right? Who are you? <laughs> okay. Okay, you two go together. We're going to have John and Mark Stein to go together. And we're going to have Jason and Kevin go together. Okay, go. You got, oh, you're going to go with your biggest challenges. It's going to be a accountability partner for the next month, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Et cetera. So, uh, so, uh, so, uh, so, uh, 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 So here I am in Renata wanting to do the marketing and we're starting to do real estate investing. But then investing money and then we're not rich money and we're not going to run it. We can't touch it. It goes back to retirement. So finances is really beneficial for me. Sometimes this thing is the biggest so are you because I have all my notifications no, pop up and I'll I have some know people what I know now well, about email me an email last year when my husband and I joined, we were interested in marketing for education. So we took the Sunchester Real Estate, and I'm very glad we did. It's not as a great program, but I'm really glad we did. We learned what we did, and we started deals right away. So I did a piece of the class, and now I've gotten interested in marketing, and I'm learning all the valuable training and information that's available, and I've learned how to do it, and I'm starting to do it. I got the boss to make the club, and he's been using it anyway. So, yeah, and one of the investor guys that we've invested with before that was not involved in us, he also wants to sign it. So I got my first two people. So I'm hoping the money's going to start coming. <laughs> How about you? Uh, well, I've just been over there. Okay. 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 I have the skills to do that stuff. Mm -hmm. um, and so, because of things that we want, we need to take yeah. more civil engagement. Like, we're trying to. Like speaking, I'm not ready to start. 
So what would you like me to hold your hand? Kevin and Jason Chow. They want to talk about the so we're working on the my frustration. I know, are you a um, girlfriend? Yeah, are all these Okay, your sister's Yeah, Okay, I work on these in that but I'm trying to pay off the debt that I have since the kids have seen. Okay. And uh, I just work a lot. By the time I get home, I'm going to have So, how many hours are you putting into the day? Um, well, right now I'm shooting for 10. Okay. Um, but I can actually put aside down and take a day, two hours to do this, so like 15 to 20. So, like, yeah. So, like, well, I'm trying to cut down my hours all day, but I have to make sure. That what I do is a lot of stuff with the GPA because I'm not for right now. Okay. And so I have to make sure that I'm like colorful on leads and like setting screen instead of just making phone calls and taking okay. not having anything. She's a distraction. So I hate making phone calls. Well you know that can all be bad. Is it sitting on the phone? Yeah. I don't mind the phone calls. I love talking to person. I'm in person basically. Yeah. Person -based yeah. Person -based. So, 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 so trying to um, press up the session and activation because uh, there's x-rays you know, that build and you know, our build a lot of experience okay. for the commission you know, and all of that. Like, I need that type of thing. Right. Right. Make phone calls and make the book. Right. So it's going to be three hours, you know, five hours a week. Or what else right. So what's your goal over the next month? How many billable hours would you like to see yourself get? Because if you don't know that ahead of time, you're going to be failing in this month. Okay, so I definitely want to like, set up the and so I for you. so I'm just trying to think of what specific with concrete kind of goal can we have yeah. that I can look at for. Mm -hmm. Everybody's going to call your accountability partner in a week? I resonate with him. Yes. Yes? Yes. yes. 